guys, I, sorry, the sun is like right there, so I'm kind of blinded a little bit, but um, Easter is in just a few days, and I don't know why I kind of spaced putting together Harper's Easter basket. Like, I know that she's a baby, and she could probably go without one, but of course, as her first Easter, and as her mom, I want her to have a little something. She also doesn't have an Easter dress. Um, my cousin actually just gifted her a dress that I think could be her Easter dress if I don't find anything. And I really want to get her like a little hat. I have a hat in our playroom that I got from the dollar store a few years ago. And one morning I put it on her and <laughs> I just thought it was like, it completely melted my heart. Basically, I am going into Target and I'm gonna go shopping for her Easter basket and her Easter outfit. Um, and then I'm also gonna go shopping for my niece's Easter basket, see if I can find anything in there for them. And so I thought that I would just take you guys along with me into the store, show you what I get for her, and then we'll go home and I'll put together her Easter basket and I'll show you like what that looks like. Their selection actually isn't that great. Like I can find some stuff if I really wanted to, like this and they have this in her size. Um, they don't have this in her size. I might have considered this. They only have it in 18 month. Actually, could technically probably fit her. So maybe I'll keep that as an option. she needs bunny ears. Yay, I'm so excited about that. Okay, now I'm going to the baby section to see if maybe I can find some treats or a toy. She's never had these little yogurt um, thingamajigs, so I think that'd be a fun little thing for her to try for the first time. And I'll put it in like a little baggie. Maybe I'll just do some puffs, because that says that it's for crawling babies, so that's the right age for her. I wonder if maybe she can start learning how to do sippy cups. It says four months plus. She's never done a sippy cup. Maybe that'd be a fun for her to like learn how to start to drink out of a straw. Um, what's this thing? What age? It says six plus months. Maybe I'll get her two of these. So this one. Yeah, we'll try those. I could do some really fun bows, but I think I'm gonna pass on that. I just saw this and I wanted to include a little bunny stuffed animal and this one it sings, if you press it. I can't get it to do it now, but it sings a little lullaby. So I'm gonna keep that as an option. These look like fun. I wonder if she would like these. Okay, I'm gonna get her these. I feel like Joe would have a fun time playing with those with her. She would be obsessed with this because she like loves ribbons and like tags. So she would really love this. I don't know if I'm gonna put it in her Easter basket. I might just get it for her. I haven't even made it to the Easter section yet, so I'm definitely in trouble. The smart thing, I didn't do this purposefully, is to pick out all of your stuff and then find the Easter basket because now I know that I need a pretty good size Easter basket. I think I'm gonna do the Easter Bunny that I have, so now I have to find an Easter basket and then bubbles, and then I'm gonna shop for my nieces. This basket is only $1.50, so I think I'm gonna go with it, and I feel like I might be able to use it for something else when she's done with it. So I found these for just a dollar, so I thought those would work for the girls, and then so far I have these. Yeah, um, I'm trying to FaceTime you. Oh. I went out in public with my hair like this. Okay, love you, bye. 
So I thought it'd be fun to include sandals for the summer um, in the girls' Easter basket. So this is what I got Jocelyn. And then I got these for Kismet. And then Sarah said that um, Eva already has sandals, but that she really likes flip-flops. And so I got her these super cute flip-flops. If they had these in my size, I would get them for myself. And then I... I cannot believe that my hair looks like this. Like, I didn't realize it was so poofy. I've been walking around like this. Anywho, I decided to put the um, two dresses back because I already have a really cute dress for her um, and I was kind of spending a lot of money on the shoes. And so I was like, you know, I could just save the 20 bucks and um, not get her an Easter dress since my cousin gifted her one. Um, so yeah, I am done with the shopping. Okay, Harper, I'm gonna see if this hat fits you. Um, <laughs> I think it looks cute. Yes, I do. <laughs> okay, so I have all of the bags here, so now I'm gonna take everything out and start assembling the baskets. So this is the dress that my cousin got her. So I got this hat, which is a little bit big on her, but I think it's adorable. Really, I just want it for like a couple of pictures. Really, you're doing most things as a parent for the picture. <laughs> At least I do. So um, I got this white one and then I'm gonna replace this ribbon with a like turquoise ribbon that ties in. Oh, what happened? Are you actually getting tired? You slept in the car. Do you need to go down for a nap? Can you wait a little bit longer and then I put you down for a nap? Okay. Okay, hopefully this will keep you happy until I'm done because it's a little too early for a nap. So here is all of the girls stuff for my nieces and then right here is all of Harper's stuff so I need to put that together. I realized that I forgot to pick up bubbles and I forgot to pick up cute little Easter bags to put these guys in so I'm gonna have to get creative. Harper has never like seen or played with bubbles and I definitely think she's at that age where she would love it and I just thought it'd be really fun. My mom had the tradition of she would go and buy me an Easter dress and then on Easter morning she would have our basket set up and then she would have my dress like next to my Easter basket so like it would usually be on the floor and like my dress would be like laid out next to my Easter basket and I was always so excited to see what Easter dress she got me that year. Like she would do it up. Like even one year she got me like those gloves that like go up to your elbows. So like I felt like a complete princess. Like she would always get me like really fancy and like a hat and gloves and like a really fancy Easter dress. And it's like one of my favorite Easter memories. And so I definitely want to carry on that tradition with Harper. And so I think in the mornings, I'll do it exactly how my mom did it. Woo! <laughs> Don't cry. <laughs> and I will have her Easter basket set up with her dress laying next to it. I'm also dying over these Easter ears. I think it'd even be cute to have her wear her Easter ears with her dress. Um, so I need to take this bunny out. Let's see if I can have it play the music now. You pull the star. Oh. Okay, so I think I found a solution for the treats. I bought these to do a video like two summers ago, and I have these Christmas bags. Okay, so this is her Easter basket and her Easter setup. I really love the way that the Easter basket came out. I wasn't sure how it was all gonna like layer and everything. Um, but yeah, I have the treats back here and then, sorry, she's ready for nap time. And then her uh, little finger friends. I just put one of the sippy cups in here because that would have taken up all of the basket if I put all three of them in here. And then of course her little Easter bunny. And then I have her hat and her dress set up. Yay! Now onto the girls. So I have all of the candy in here. I have their big chocolate Easter bunny, some little Cadbury eggs in there, a Starburst egg, and then some M&Ms. When I envisioned doing this, I pictured like little baby shoes going in here. Like I was like, oh, wouldn't that be so cute to like put little sandals in there? But I've forgotten that they've grown up. <laughs> These are not little sandals. Even um, Jocelyn's shoes, and she's the youngest, Definitely not like little, little. So I'm not exactly sure what I was thinking. Sometimes you forget like 
how quickly they grow up. So um, I'm gonna fiddle with that for a second. Actually, that worked out pretty well. It's still not quite as cute as I originally <laughs> thought it was going to be, but I think that the girls will really be excited to see it. So with that, I'm gonna end it here. Harper's playing with my phone, and I need to put her down for a nap, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video, shopping around with me, and seeing what I got the girls for Easter. I'm super excited to give it to them. I might even try and go drop it off tonight. So um, yeah, I hope that you guys have an amazing Easter. I'll probably see you one more time before then, but just in case, hope you guys have an awesome Easter and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.